Hey, what's up guys? Learning with Rich here. In this video, I'm going to show you how to install the Revit uh, Navisworks to Revit exporter. Okay, so as you can see right now, my software is Revit 2022. But in this software, I already installed here the exporter. So let me just quickly show you. So as you can see on my add-ins tab here, so there is the external panel and then if you click the external tools, so you will be able to see here the exporter, the Navisworks 2022 and then the other one is the Navisworks Switchback 2022. And also if you are going to click the file here, you can see the export and then you can also see here the NWC. So you will be able to select the NWC here if you install the exporter otherwise you will not be able to see this option okay so since I already installed it here in my Revit 2022 so I'm gonna do that here on my Revit 2020 wherein if I go to the add-ins so there is no installed external Anabisworks 2020 exporter here and also if I go to the file go to the export so there is no nwc here right because the exporter is not installed okay so let me just quickly show you where to get it okay so you can get it to this website okay so let me just back this which is this one so i'm gonna put this on the video description this link here Okay, so this is the link. I'm going to put this in this video's description. So I'm going to put the link there. And then this is where you are going to get it. The Navisworks NWC Export Utility. Of course, you can also download here the Navisworks Freedom in case you want to view the model in Navisworks. But you will not be able to edit that. So you can only view the model. You can download the Navisworks Freedom here. But that's not our concern. So our concern here is the Navisworks NWC Export Utility. So all you have to do is to uh, click the link here or download the the .exe file, the installer. So there are bunches of version here and the one that we are looking for is Navisworks Exporters 2020.exe. I already clicked this one and it's already downloaded here which is this one right so after that to install it just simply click this okay there you go and then so how about I'll just change this so I don't want to pile up my C drive so usually I just change that and then put it on my uh, D drive. So maybe I'm gonna create a new folder here. So I'll just right click new folder. Oops, not here. So let me just delete this one. So it should be here on my D drive. Oops, D drive, new folder. Okay, so I think I already have the, the Navisworks folder here. So let me just delete this. So just go inside the Navisworks there. And then as you can see, there's my exporter 2022. So I'm going to select this Navisworks folder. And then let me just resize this. And then select OK. So it's now in my D drive. So I will select here OK. And then it will now start the Autodesk self extract. Okay, so after I install this one, I'm going to show you where to find it on Revit 2020. All right, so I'll be right back. Okay, so after extracting the installer, so you will now be able to see this user control or user account control. Do you want to allow this app to make changes to your device? Just select here, yes. Okay, and then... You will now go to the setup initiation so you just need to install on this computer okay so i'm located in new zealand just accept that and then select next okay so there's your exporter install it 32 bit 64 bit just select install 
And while this export is being exported or is being installed, okay, so let me just quickly show you. So to those of you who are just uh, new in my channel, you can uh, avail all the exercises files, training files that I'm using in my video. Of course, I can give you a couple of files for free. If you want to try out some of my videos, all you have to do is to comment on the video that you would like. You comment your email address, and then after that, I'm going to send you the training file. But after that, of course, education has an investment, right? So if you want to get all the exercise files, so you can just go to this website. Again, it's on the video description, so you can just click there. And then you can click here what the exercises files that you would like. Okay, and then there's a corresponding amount. I think it's $15 and $20. Okay, you just need to go to this link to get all the exercises files. And also, um, uh, please uh, do me a favor. So I am creating videos for free and please do me a favor by going to the Rumble channel. This is my another channel wherein I am uploading all the videos that I am doing aside from YouTube. Okay, so the exercises is also here in this Rumble channel. The only difference is that here in my Rumble channel, I already uploaded here the examination uh, videos for Revit MEP and uh, Revit Architecture and Revit Architecture. You can go to this uh, channel to my Rumble channel for you to be able to see the the videos that I have created for the examination. Okay, again, just go to the Rumble channel, look for Revit TV, and follow me. And if you're gonna open one video, let's say for example this one, so kindly please click here this plus button. So it's like a like button. So but they call it here Rumble. Okay, so every video that you will watch in my Rumble channel, please do me a favor by clicking this plus icon. Okay, and also don't forget to follow my Revit TV Rumble channel. Now, after installing it, let me just check. Okay, so it's now already installed. So let me now finish this one. And then let's go back to our Navisworks. Our oh, Revit, I mean. So let's go to Revit. Okay, so here... You can see it's Revit 2022.5. So from add-ins, you can now see here the external tools. So this is what I'm talking about. A while ago, this is not yet in. But since we already installed the exporter, it's now here. And actually, we don't need to close the Revit 2020, right? I leave it open. And after that, it automatically updates. And then if we go to the file here, Go to export so you can now see here the NWC available for you. Okay, so hopefully you have learned something from this video. If you have any comments, questions, or suggestions, you can put it on the comment section below and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Thank you for watching. Have a nice day.